Hello everybody, this is Sonia. I'm in Australia and I'm, I'm going to work on this little book today because I just want to. I sort of, um, I thought I wouldn't be doing as much on camera but I really am keen to do some. So, um, I've got some brads because I want to put a book in there um, and I'm going to fasten it on with a brad. So I'll just sit that there, maybe, maybe out of the way, might be a good idea. And then I've got some bits here that I'm going to find the stuff to make a book out of. And I have got the, book, the makings, I know I do, because all this stuff has been uh, I've got all these little tiny bits of that I cut off fabric because I had little flowers every here and there, you know, it wasn't all over it. So I put, I've cut all them up so I could use them as little bits, so that's good. And I must have something in here. I wanted a piece of um, material. Here we go. Now that is actually a paper clip, that one there, so I could probably use that because it's only small. It's in one of them invisible ones. I'll show you to do that one in a minute. We've seen all these things before, but there's bits for books here too. <laughs> like that's a surprise. Oh, okay, this is cool. I like this. This looks a little bookish, doesn't it? Um, it's not big enough though. It's wrong, wrong size, wrong thing. How about we use this? What we got here? Oh, I like to put the owl in too. I'm going to put the owl in there somewhere. <laughs> I will. Um, so this will this will work, won't it? I'll put these into this and cover it with got to put something on the outside put something on the outside we'll find something to put on the outside when we've done it okay and then it's got to be fastened onto the um gee i've got to, just enough room here <laughs> okay right now we're going to do a book okay so this is a piece of that really nice fabric that i bought last week at the week for last at the grad sale i think that's what this is i don't know it looks like it could be so I've got some bits here that may, that will fit. I'm always chopping up paper. I've got paper chopped up everywhere. So, I don't think I'm going to worry about making it the right size. Does that matter? No, we're not going to worry, are we? Let's see what this looks like. That's cool. Okay, let's get some more pages in. That'll do. Right oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I was watching Natasha from Treasure Books and she was making these tiny little ones with leather outside cases on them okay now I'm I was going to do that myself but my leather is where is that I've got them okay I could have got someone to get me the box down never mind and you know what I get the leather off it the pieces of the so I get nice colors and that handbags from the opportunity shops you just pull them apart and cut the nice bits off and keep them and I've got some up there but I can't get over there now I'm sitting here in a posse and I've got a irritable leg, <laughs> I suppose you could call it that. And so I don't want to get up and move about because it's, um, if it gets in the wrong place it's not happy. So I'm going to just stay where I am and just do it with this. But if you want to do it with leather on it or faux leather or whatever you want to make it out of, just go and buy yourself like a, a little purse or a handbag or something. And only a few dollars at the um, thrift shops. Make sure it's got no... Um, scratches or stuff on it. You probably get near new ones because I have bought in the past. I wish I could actually reach that to show you what I do. I will definitely get it down for the next video though when I figure out where it is. Should have it written on there somewhere. Uh -huh. No, I can't see it on any of those. Oh yes, yeah, so everything got moved and now I can't find nothing. It'll be somewhere though. We'll, we'll look later. But that's what you use. Just cut off a piece of out of your thing because unless you've got somewhere that you can buy that, it's the best way that I found to get it, collecting it up like that. So this is going to be a little journal. Might need a little bit more string than that. Make it together. I'm going to put a bit more string on it. Get another needle. That'll be easy enough done, won't it? And I'll put it on the inside. Is that right? That's not really straight, that is it? It's like 
Uh, it doesn't matter. We're not doing the straight thing, are we, remember? We're just doing the whatevers. <laughs> just go on with it, okay? I'm actually going to put a three-hole pamphlet stitch on this, I think. I don't think I do mine the way everybody else does, but, you know, that doesn't matter. Just as long as you've got three holes and it's stitched in, I think. I don't know. I think that's probably right. As long as you've got it stitched on somehow, look, you've made a mistake there. You come out the wrong place. Well, see, that happens. When you poke something through from this side, you don't necessarily going to get it to come out the right place on this side. See how that went a bit wrong? There you go. Now it's right. Now through. Okay. I should be an expert at this. <laughs> I do it every day nearly, don't I? I do love books. I do love books. So I always take my piece down in under there. Other people do it different. And then you tie, tie it. When you tie it, you sort of pull it this way, across like that, okay, and then do another one, another knot, and if you're careful, you don't want to tear it, pull it so it rips, just tear it, just pull it nicely, you've got the knot tied in there carefully, and there you've got a little book. Okie dokie, that's real easy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do more because I want to do small, smaller ones. <laughs> smaller ones. Well, my book's only tiny. The my journal thing I'm making is only tiny, isn't it? Okay. This journal would be more for um, putting your personal bits and pieces in, you know, so it's all yours. Nobody else, you know, needs to have to look at it for you, do they? They don't have to be there. Oh, I do like this bit. I like that bit. What else have I got over here? But, um, it's be something. Oh, hang on. I might put this on. I might put this on here. What do you reckon? Mm, yeah, that looks pretty cool, actually. Um, paper. I've got some nice pictures. I've got some nice pictures about. Um, do I need a bit of lace behind it or not? There's a this bit here. Okay. Cut a bit off that and put on it. I do like this puzzle piece. Hang on. Uh, no, 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 no. Metal leaf. Leaf in a puzzle piece. Mm -hmm. Right, that could work if you didn't have them all on there, just just one. I don't know. Why not? It's different, isn't it? Okay. Oops. Hmm. Get that bit off. Okie dokie. I don't know. Probably not. after all that. <laughs> it does take time to do things. It does take time. Okay. Okay. Right. I do have a lot of stuff that's, that's pretty cool that can go on here. Mm. I'm going to use this bit. I'll right, have to take the sticky off the back. It's really overcast outside today, but it is so hot. It is really, really hot. Um, I come in here fairly early to get some things done before the before it gets too bad. It's going to be. Um, 36 or something today, I think. It was 37 yesterday. <clears throat> but it's not too bad, because we're, we're lucky enough that we're inside here with the um, air conditioning. Oh, dear. Now, the, I know that this is probably some people know, but maybe lots don't, because yesterday, our neighbour, who has not been... That house hasn't been across the road very long, and he, I think he's renting. And he had to get—he got the um, 
his air conditioning on the roof looked at because it wasn't keeping him cool but that's because it's water one and the water ones don't work as good as the that's interesting you can't even really tell that that's a full the water ones don't work as good as the um, refrigerated ones like we have refrigerated ones because you know like like they got in the shops well, some of them might have water ones I don't know but it's because it's so hot here in Australia and in where we live in parks you have to have now that's not working for me is it so just put that in there um, you just have to have something like them because it doesn't you, you can't um, get cool it's just it's all um, humid it makes it all humid those water things um, and I've sort of sort of felt for him because I don't think he's lived in parks very long maybe he thought that that was going to make him cool but they're not going to work they're not going to work like ours is just like walking into a fridge when you walk into the room you know it's not that bad but it's, it's really you've got to keep it cool I remember the girl next door years ago come over here from her place once for some reason I don't see one of my daughters or something and she said oh can I stay here <laughs> because they have a they have one of the same things over at their place and they just don't do the job properly they can't because of the you know the temperatures and the and the water makes like I said the humidity so here's me Brad's <clears throat> anyway see how he goes if he's <laughs> there's nothing I suppose he can do about it he just has to he just has to have that um, because I think he rents that house over there I think he bought it anyway so let's put something on here we need a bread so we can hang something to onto it um, and I'm gonna put it on in here I think right let's make a hole don't want a very big hole it's just more one I'm hoping that that book's going to come across there and oh no, I'll stick something else over it, make something, put something pretty over it. So I want to put that in there, but I need, before I close, make it close down, sorry about this, I cannot get hold of it properly. I've got it now, right? So now I need to put a piece of string or something on there because I want it to stay fastened. I wonder if that'll stay in under there. If I, if I tie it there, push it there, do something of the such thing. <laughs> you're too little now, lost it. Come on, you're in here somewhere. I know you are, seeing you fall. Come here. Right. Maybe I should put that string through the hole. What do you reckon? Can I do this? Can I do that? Come on. It's coming out, look. I bet it's not all through there, though. Nah, look at this curling up and being quite painful. I'm here licking my tongue out. <laughs> I'm not going to lick it because it'll only make it go fatter, won't it? Thicker. Come on, get in there. So you don't want to do this at home, do you? That's not fun, is it? Look, there's a piece of this threaded on here. Let's use this bit. This will work better, won't it? Look, it's all threaded on the cotton. On the needle, I should say. So did I drop my little brad there or back in here? I'll get another one. There's lots of them. I'll find that one later. I don't know. I'll put that in there like that. Maybe I'll add this a bit longer. Now, this look is leaves food for thought doesn't it you've got that bit <laughs> I can cut it off later if I don't think it's long if I don't think it's right you put that through there we're going to open it up and squish it down whoops all right here we go we we'll squish that down now don't ask me what I'm going to do with it now I think I'll have to just end that off there all right I'll keep that shredded on there because that could come in handy it could come in handy and we're going to put something something there and I'm going to put a uh, 
something I want a hole in that bit so I can fasten this <laughs> the piece of string that I just cut off <laughs> I don't think that's long enough you couldn't possibly use that oh Sonia <laughs> let's try this again eh what we were trying to do was have enough string so we could tie it up to the top bit right now let's do this again so put it through the hole with that and oh, I'll hang on I have to take it out now put it through the hole right now keep some Sonia don't cut it off now put this through here like this you forgot what you were doing didn't you you just went off on a trip somewhere else in your brain okay now there you go that's on there now now let's let's put this down and put a bit of, bit of string underneath it and put it down so it won't come undone we do not want it to go anywhere I don't know. like so now we cut that bit off there yes don't cut the other piece off yet hang on a second until I just move this out of my road for a minute I need something on this inside on its inside piece here I need something on there to hold that down so I can put on a piece of material why not it's a bit too big I'll cut it down in half cut that in half I'm only working with the small things now. I love small things. I do, I do love making things little. Little bits and pieces. It's good fun. A bit of glue. And I'll fasten that down so. Like this. Right here. Now you can put a little stamp on there if you wanted to. Probably a bit later. Might do that a bit later. Okay. So this is going to go in here and it's going to be <coughs> on a piece of string because so it doesn't get lost. So if you took it out of there and you've, if it, you've got that much, right, and you push it in there and it's staying there, righto. So we're going to put another brad maybe through here or make a hole. And we've got it on the other side. We've just got a plain paper so, so far. So we can push the... I might put a brad in it because I do like the way that they work. They'll hold, they'll hold it down nicely. And I think the other things are in another place. I don't know. When I say the other things, my um, oh, this is a this is a square one. Look, it's got a leaf on it. And it could go in there like that. Mm, I suppose it looks all right. I suppose it looks okay. Didn't think I'd ever use these. I wasn't a big fan when I first got them, but they don't look too bad, do they? If I hold that on there, no, I want to take it through there so it doesn't come out, it doesn't go away. Wait a minute. Okay, where's that needle? I just put I just put a needle in here. It just disappeared, didn't it? When I put it in there. Oh, here it is. Right. Too many things in the one box there. Don't knock them on the floor. Mm. Yeah. Right, come on. Right, now take that through. Okay, because breads are really easy to work with, I reckon. I don't think I'm really keen on that one there, you know, I'm not real... I'm not a big fan of putting that there. I might put a, something else interesting up there, what do you reckon? Oh, there's a little spider. Oh, dear. Go away, you little pet. Shoo, shoo. Don't you want you playing around here near me? Go away. You crawl on me, I'll, <laughs> ah, I'll scream. Oh, Jeremy found this great big, and I'm not kidding, like it'll fit in my hand. He's actually had in the past some in the shed drawer, I might have told you that, and he caught it in a glass the other night and he put it outside and I said, oh, can't you squash it? He said, oh, no, it's only a husband spider. He said, it'll be fine. Ah, oh, dear, I said, well, it'd make, it'd kill me if it come <laughs> because I'd die fright myself. <laughs> but not, not harmless as far as I was concerned. Now we need to pull a bit of this through here. A bit more string. So we've got some here to hold. We're going to wrap it around that that 
red so it will hold onto it both sides like you've got now you got hold of it look hopefully it's going to stay there but we'll do what we did with the other one and we'll put something on top of it so it'll it won't go anywhere now I hope oh, I just feel that spider's walking on me but it can't be it's surely, it's surely he's gone away by now I smacked at him he might be a baby, the father one we found, I don't know. But anyway, it might have been a mother one. It's it. Your mother's out the back if it's you. <laughs> oh dear. He used to have them in his drawer out the back and in the shed and he'd open the drawer and you'd see him running at the back. Ah, oh, the big furry things they were. Oh dear. <laughs> didn't bother him, but I, I didn't like to go out there, that's for sure. Okay, so I've done that and put that in there. Right here, oh, that seems like it's a nice idea. I quite like that. Right, we'll leave that there like that. And now we'll go over here and we'll do something about this piece here. We'll put something over the top of it. I want to make one of these paper clips and show you how to do those because it's only a very small one, um, the invisible paper clip. And I hope I got the packet with the paper clips in here somewhere. I surely have. I surely have. <laughs> I can still feel that. He's not walking on me, I'll bet. But I can, I'm, I'm sure he is, you know. <laughs> So this paper clip is only a small paper clip. I think I've only got coloured ones of those. I might just leave out a couple of pins because I might need them. Oh. That's interesting, there's a little thingy there. Okay. Well see it doesn't matter what colour they are because but I couldn't find any. I don't think I could find any small ones at the time I was looking for them. Well, maybe there's one there, there's a metal one. I can use him. That's the way. Use that one. Right. Do you think he's running down my leg biting me as he goes? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> oh, sorry, people. <laughs> I don't mind spiders, but they've got to be way over there, you know, not near me. Everybody's got its place, and it just needs to go over that way a bit. Mm. Okay, so now to make one of these, I will get a bit of calico, because I do love a bit of calico. And I have to work with calico, the best thing ever. It's good stuff. It doesn't cost, well, it is a bit expensive, but I managed to pick up a real lot of it second hand, and it's just not, it's not being used, but it's in, the, in those shops, you know, opportunity places where we go. Right, so we need a piece. I'm only going to, this one's a thicker one and this one will be not so wide okay but I'm gonna fill back this and fill that back there probably that spider hasn't even got any teeth yet he's probably just because he's only tiny when you think it was wasn't even big as a fly it's a tiny spider anyway I'll be fine you sort of got me <laughs> I'll use it there I'm not on my own I'm not on my own. Now I need a piece of paper underneath it, so I'm going to use a bit off of the movie but Oh no, I'll use a bit of this. <clears throat> hey, I could have put that in something. Right, hang on, a bit of this bit. A bit of this bit. It doesn't matter what you put under there, because you're not going to see it anyway. We'll just get a bit off here. We'll make a pocket out of that later. Yeah, for, well, something that won't matter if it bends a bit, because it's a little bit... Um, fragile that paper right you need two these two things to be the same length radio so I'll cut that there and I think I'll just take this straight just for the purpose of making it level right now all you got to do is... So this is kicking up there, that's not a good start to the thing, is it really? I might lay down when I glue it on, I suppose. Is this long enough? Not quite. We might have to cut that off a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. And take off that bit there. Fold it over this way further. So you want two pieces the same length. It doesn't matter whether you use two pieces of paper or two pieces of fabric, it will still work. I like to put the paper underneath it and if I was 
yes, I think I would like to put something that's a bit heavier underneath it than that. I want something a bit stiffer. Because I think it'll go it goes on a bit better if you've got something stiffer. After doing all that, I've changed my mind. But that's okay, we're allowed to. Because as you're working away, you can discover that what you're doing right or wrong. Come on, there's got to be a piece of something here somewhere in this thing. This is a bit heavier than that anyway, this will do. This is a bit of card this is a bit of paper, like but it's good it's a heavy one, so if I cut down there I can make two. I can make two. Right. So just make sure that you can't really see that. It doesn't matter, but it doesn't, you know. Just cut up there above that. Right. Now fold it in half. Put a paper clip on there like that you see and then you put glue <coughs> lots of glue and get that bit off the beginning of it there you go too and we're going to glue this all over okay I hope you can hear me all right. I've got the fan behind me because I have to. Uh, that spot is bite me. It <laughs> bite me at all. I'm being silly. Sorry, people. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not a cranky person, so I'll be, you know, I'm just a reasonably happy person, I suppose. Some things upset me, but I'm not very, not very easily angered by much. It's to be really bad for me to, you know, think of the, you know, I'm, I've stuck this on here and it's drying and I'm fiddling and, you know, but what are you going to do, Sonia? You should have made it straight before it dried. Put it on sideways. Let's unstick it. Let's unstick it and stick it back down again. Now, go, go careful this time. Straight. All straight. Look. There we go. That's better. You can really see it that side, can't you? That doesn't matter because we can do embellishments on there. Because now all you have to do is, oh well, you can lift up this if you need to, to peep through here, and then it just goes on your. Why? What have I done? Have I glued something down? I think I did. I did. I did. I did. I've got glue on there. Make sure you haven't glued something down, okay? Because then it goes on there like that, see? And it's an invisible paper clip, which we've done previously, of course. Okay, so now I'd better put a something on there, hadn't I? A bit of something, something. So it'll be covered over and look nicely. Like this piece of lace here, this is flash. I could go either side, couldn't it? Actually, it's a bit of tatting. There's a bit of tatting that I've got here. I don't know why, but there's, there's, um, now there's a little bug flying around me. There's a little, little creatures outside. <laughs> I've got screens on my house. I don't think they all woke up today, did they, or something? It's really getting really dark outside. That's weird. We might get some storms or rain or something. Now, I want to put that so it's not... Um, I'm going to cut this off here. Well, as far as I know, you can just chop up your tatting as well as what you can your crochet because it's only one thread that you're cutting. Did that make that look a bit like it's not... It's more interesting instead of flat down one side. That's right. Yes, that's really good. I like that. Okay, now I'm going to glue that on. Okay. I haven't figured out what I'm going to do with this yet. I've got glue everywhere now. Oh dear. I'll get my paper towel off the roll and that might help me a bit if I need to find it to wipe things. I hope I'm in the shot here. I'm waving these things about all over the place. Okay. Because I've got a camera, my camera has a <laughs> has the 
excuse me, the screen on the side of it. I'm thinking the screen should be lined up with what I'm doing, but it's not. It's the camera that should have got to be lined up with what I'm doing. Okay, now something else on that. Something small, pretty, and interesting. I don't know. What do we have here? There's some flowery bits of them. Any flowery bits? That box here somewhere with heaps of stuff in it. I've got all these ready because I'm doing. See me what I got in this look, so I can go in and pick out what I need to do some of these with. I've been making these. I have these are snippet things, little you know little bits that you can just put into something. Okay, so I need a, do I need a butterfly on that pink one? Pink one. Okay, maybe, maybe a pink butterfly, maybe a button. No, I don't like that button. I'll find something else. Wait a minute. Hope I didn't hit, stick that in there too wrong. You know, I do like a butterfly. They are good to put on embellishments, aren't they? And he's going to have to have some bling on him, isn't he? He can't be like that and just plain, plain ordinary butterfly. Plain all run in the middle butterfly. Um, I don't know if I've got little ones of these here. Small ones, anyway. No. You're going to have to take some mounts on this thing to see what you're doing. That's all there is to it. Oh, I do like the hearts. They've been hidden in there for a while. If you can't go through it and look at everything all the time, you don't probably think about it or you don't have time or whatever. I'm just going to leave these hearts out here a minute. Maybe the... I don't know, maybe not. I need to put these in a... In the other stuff. I'll get myself a better button. This is in the... Um, one of those sets where, you know, where you put your seasonings and things in. My hubby likes plain cooking so we don't do any old oh, I eat curry so we have curry, pepper, salt some flavours but not a lot a lot of people do lots of flavouring I'm not being I wasn't brought up or raised with flavouring at all so my mother wasn't a very adventurous cook and that's alright I suppose I've some people to cook lots of different stuff. We were very basic around here. Very basic. Gets a bit boring after a while, but you know. Oh, when you go and try something new, you want to be careful that you might gonna, you're going to like it. Otherwise, you're going to have to you have to have a backup if you want to have something different. <laughs> if you want to try cooking something different, there's got to be always a backup meal. And I've got a really old thumbtack in there. As long as I don't touch it, I guess I'll be fine. It's going to stick in me. <sighs> I know, I do know now what I'm after, after all that. I do know what I'm looking for. Wait a minute. Ooh, here it is. I know oh, this will do. I think we can do two of these on here. Look at this. We can stick these on here and that comes up over the top. Oh, look at that, look at that go. That looks good, doesn't it? Righto. I did that the other day with one. I still haven't sorted out my glue pots. Because I was really hot by the time I left out, moved out of here yesterday afternoon, and didn't come back in here again until this morning. We're getting up at half past six, so we can get some of the fresh air and the nice of the day before it all has to go. That look good, yeah. Before it all goes hot and sideways, <laughs> everything goes hot. It's too hot to handle. Well, that's a dear little paper clip, isn't it? Look at that. I'm happy with that. Mm. Okay, it's a bit here. I'm, I'm, I don't know if I want to fast him all on. 
I'll just put a bit on him under him, eh? You can lift up a little bit. But after he's been in the book, he's going to sit down squash anyway, isn't he? He's going to be sitting down squash anyway. That's a paper clip for our book. Mm. For our little junk thing. What are we going to do? I'm going to stick something. Ah, okay. Very good. Oh, we're going to do the other side. We might have to do that later. Can't hold you up much too. Now let's do something different, eh? We only got ten minutes left. <laughs> <Put me ten. laughs> but we needed to put the little book in. We needed to put our booklet in there so we can write in that. And now we can do something here. Something, something. Uh, I do love this paper. I do love this paper. Do I need another pocket or what do I need to put on this one? Uh huh. You need to cover that. An owl. It can be a tuck spot, can't he? Yeah, he can look really good as a tuck spot. Let's turn this off. You know what this is? This is out of the um, uh, photo albums. I've bought some photo albums from the minis and places like that, and they've got. Um, these pages in as well as parts that you put you stick your um, things onto your, <laughs> your photos and so it's really cool to use in your books because I, I, I like it it's really neat stuff this this little owl and it can be a tuck spot it can be a tuck spot it go me. I should have put something behind him first, though, shouldn't I, instead of just throwing him on down there. Okay. Have we got any time for this? Is that going to work? Yes, it is. It's going to come off. And if it didn't, I would have just fixed it and made it work for me somehow. We need it to look a bit straggedy. Is that what I've done in the front? Oh no, it's not the same thing. What sort of a thing have I got there? I've got a pocket. And this is going to be a pocket too. Or maybe it's a bit bigger than a pocket. If I put that under there, that can be like a tuck thing, can't it? And I can just fasten this down. You know, I was going to staple that on there just for fun. <laughs> Maybe not. Because I've got to stick it properly so it'll stay there. Okay, so let's put him over here. Because I think this will look alright. Is this the right side that I'm putting glue on? <laughs> Is this going to work? It's a tuck thing. Another tuck thing. Yeah. We can have another tuck thing. Different sort of tuck. This one's a nice owl. It's a tucky owl. Yeah. In there, Sonia. In this way. In there, look. And you really can't tell because of the... So we need a bit of a thing, don't we? What's one of them things, you know? So you can tell there's something going on. Tab, something. You got a tab in here? Oh, goodness me. You must have something there, Sonia. All this stuff. Maybe I'll have it somewhere else. I'll have some somewhere else. Okay, righto, let's just get serious now about this. Here's one. There's two. Nothing to do with that yet. Oh boy, I've got one of those. There's a little ticket. So if, if you've got all your good bits about, you know, you want to try and f see if you can use them. Put them all together. Try and get together some um, things so you can 
Let this go on here like this. <laughs> ah, do you want to go? Please go for me. Go. Getting my hands out of the road so you can see. It's not a, not a, not an idea. I need something um, half a round or something, don't I? I need half a circle. I need half a circle. Oh look, I've, I've only got all of a circle, but it's pink. It's a pink circle. No, pink. No, it's a pink circle. Not today. Oh, this is cool. There's something I did earlier when I was trying to. I was practicing something, but I can use that in here too, can't I? You know what? I've got something to show you. I mean, wonder, wonder, wonder what I did with that. <laughs> I've got something to show you. Let's see what I did with it. Oh, silly. I got this um, thing the other day. A punch thing. I wonder what I did with that. Oh, I've been trying to lay up on this and then I've got the thing here. Here it is. When I went to Can Assist the other day, I found this. And it goes in my box, went in the box sale thing. So what it does is, and this is what brought me to, to it. I hope it's right. You know, so you open it like that. Okay. And it's, um, put that in there. And you press down. Come on, come up. Back open. All right. And it makes that hole look. Then you can put your ribbon through there and tie that up. Can't you? Brilliant, Sonia. How long do you want this to be? <laughs> so I'll put that up there like that. And cut this up here like this. I don't know. How, oh, truth. I don't know where it come from. I suppose it looks like it's something that's come out of a, um, a shop. Or, or, um, you have to put it right down in there. Oops, wait a minute. Make sure you got it right. You got to put it right down in there, for, and make it make it straighter as straight as you can. If I can. Come on. Okay. So now I've got two bits like that, and then I've got to get this here, or well, whatever, or, or some piece of ribbon would probably be better and then you can put it through there and you can do then whatever you want to with it you know oh you can see the better on this other side can't you we've got a bit of ribbon that wide anyway no of course i wouldn't have sitting over there behind me the ribbon is i haven't got it out of the box yet still sitting over there waiting for something to be done look at that isn't that cool and then i can do something something with that so i was really pleased about that didn't actually have this bit on it, but I thought, now that must go with it. And I think this is for catching the bits, is it? I don't know. It hasn't caught anything yet. Well, it's not there unless it's stuck somewhere else. I don't know. wonder what happened to them bits. It's a pretty heavy-duty thing. Oh, here they are, here. Pretty heavy-duty thing, so... That wasn't a bad find for somebody that's going to do a few... <laughs> Maybe make a couple of things with it one day. Yes, you never know, do you? Right. Okay. Now. What am I up to? I'm trying to find out what to do here so I can see this, aren't I? And I did put my little paper clip thing in here somewhere, didn't I? This here I need to glue down here. I need to glue this. It's important that I do. Okay. So this is fixing up my book. I'll just do this for another minute because then I've got to go. I have to go because I'm... Your time will be up and I need to go and do something else. So that's just going to go on there because it's got glue all over it. And I wanted to cover it over. And then I'm going to have to cut this here level. Just only for this piece we're going to do leveling. Only for that bit. Okay. We'll just do leveling for that. And here. <laughs> and then I've got to glue this bit here down. because it was a ah, bit of glue now. Right, down this way.
I'm thinking about making a um, sample journal and I might do that with all the different techniques and things that I can come up with <laughs> you know but a lot of my journals they've got lots of different bits and pieces in them but I just I thought it'd be nice if you know you could just get a, a sampler you know make a sample for other people have done that I think before now this is cool look at that I've got a tuck spot there I'm going to open that a bit and then I've got this over here, this page here. Anyway, that goes there goes the thing, doesn't it? So I have to I can tear this off a tiny bit. You stop and I'll just tear this down here and then I'll have to go. And I'll come back on here and I'll see what I'm gonna be doing next in this, I think. I might do another little tiny video on it and then I'm gonna figure out what else I want to do. I know I have the green ink but I don't know what I did with my little dobbin thing because I took it out there with me last night. There it is. <laughs> Got it. Last night I did a bit of making. Um, only uh, things for me kits that I want to put up shortly. Man this inky thing have a terrible time don't we? We're going with the green on this one today. I do like the green. I'm quite partially green. I need to do all the pages, I think. You put some white on it too, I guess, but you know, we'll do green this one. And I've got to do something about this page here and finish this one, so I'll come back in a minute and do that, okay? So thank you everybody for watching. Now stay safe and if you're cold, get warm, and if you're hot, stay cool. <laughs> okay, thank you for watching. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.